Annyeong SAO! Welcome to Afternoon of Delight, where Leah, Megan, and Amy, romance novelists and your K romance guides. So grab some deck bokey and listen to your new favorite unnees. Hey, everybody. Hello. Hi there. Did you guys play kissing games? What do you mean, kissing mm, games? Like spin the bottle? Yeah. Seven and like minutes in seven he- minutes in heaven? Yeah. Yeah. Did you ever like go in and do seven minutes in heaven? Yeah. Did you get to heaven? Seven minutes in heaven when I was like in sixth grade was just like tongue kissing. That's yeah, all we did. Did I tell you I caught? Wait, did I tell you how there I found Worcestershire sauce upstairs? <laughs> what? Wait, did I tell you guys about this? Yeah, I found a bottle of Worcestershire sauce just like in the hallway upstairs, like near the bedrooms. And I was like, um. <laughs> and like it w- clearly was not my son because I just know. So I texted my daughter because she was like at a friend's house. And I was like, why was there Worcestershire sauce upstairs? Like, how did it get up there? And she was like, oh, I was playing a game with it. But don't worry, I didn't drink it. And I was like, actually, you drinking it was like the worst of my or was like the least of my worries. Like, what were you doing (laughs) with a bottle of Worcestershire sauce? So she had been at home with like one of her friends. So I was like, did you? Like, so when she came home, I'm like, I need more details. Like, what did you do? (laughs) Why did you have this bottle of sauce? Because it was just so weird. And she's like, we were playing spin the bottle. Who? And I was like, do you? Okay. Like, I mean, if she wants to play spin the bottle with, like, her girlfriend, like, that's fine. Which is, like, one of the friends? Oh, yeah. Worcestershire. I was confused. Yeah, we're spinning the Worcestershire sauce. And I was like, so what, what, like, how do you play spin the bottle? She's like, well, if it landed on someone, they just had to, like, do a dare. And I was like, oh, okay, <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> like, <laughs> I mean, again, like, however you want to play Spin the Bottle, I mean, <laughs> but it just was, like, her and her friend, and clearly they didn't play Spin the Bottle the way, like, I played Spin the Bottle. But anyway, okay, go ahead about your kissing games. I'm sorry. <laughs> Detour. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Leah, you're muted. How do you go click on the microphone at the bottom? What the <laughs> fuck is happening? <laughs> I couldn't find it. I couldn't oh find the home page. I couldn't. Oh my God, so yeah. I was, I've okay. got like okay. 50 pages open. And so of for some reason, do. I like <sighs> clicked out um, to look at the screen. One of those tabs is for sure going to be Facebook Messenger. <laughs> yeah, you probably have faced. <laughs> I should say like 11 of those tabs are probably Facebook Messenger. <laughs> she's probably like, don't I need a different tab for each conversation? <laughs> All right, go, so go, I go. I find out to look at the script and then I couldn't find you again. So I was trying to signal like, just keep talking. I'll find you. Oh I didn't know <sighs> okay. that like, is the signal for that? <laughs> <laughs> if you can't see, it was a lot of hand waving and <laughs> silent mouth moving. <laughs> It was like I was in Titanic being like, get on the life raft. Leave me. I'm OK. My time has come. Oh, God. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, about kissing games. Yeah. So, you know, there were those games. Then there was like, you know, Truth or Dare, which, you know, apparently Megan's daughter does like a very clever amalgamation of both. And then for, you know, there's also this or that. And we did, mm-hmm. you know, we found out that we did not know that Amy was a this or that savant but she's quite good at it but we just decided to do this or that as just kind of like a fun like let's just you know whatever it's our podcast and we can enjoy ourselves so that was kind yeah. of what we decided to do just yeah. k-drama and style page- we're not just doing a yeah. random this or right. that it's k-drama style and our yeah. patreon members also seem to like it and they also gave some suggestions as well which we're excited to some are do. painful yeah yeah so we're gonna I actually start, didn't read through all of them, but I'm excited. We're going to start by just warming up with some easy ones. Then okay. we're going to flip to some ones that were offered by our Patreon. And then we're going to go to the harder level, host level ones. Okay. 
And I don't think I'm actually, weirdly, I'm not very good at this. So I'm going to defer to my host as, you know. I don't know if I'm going to be able to top the Gudong Mei one because I think that's. Well, Megan's feeling very confident. I know. We'll see. I am feeling really confident in my this or that. I'm actually really excited about that. I sat, I was actually like on the couch. Okay. I was on the couch grinning to myself. My husband was like (laughs) running to the grocery store and he was like asking me, like, oh, what do we need? And I'm just sitting on the couch just being giddy. And he's like, what? are you doing like he probably thinks i'm like texting you know the pool boy we don't have a pool boy i'm kidding or but you pool. know what i mean <laughs> i know we don't have a pool either <laughs> why well, i said pool boy but he probably thought i was like i don't know <laughs> had some man on the side but no it was just me writing this or that for you two so i'm excited all right well let's do some warm-ups these are just very easy but this is just to like get everyone in the mood and if you're at home Mm -hmm. you know you just shout out your answers too so i can do these just to like warm it up okay Mm -hmm. okay so where to watch a drama netflix or vicky i mean i prefer vicky subs so um i would choose vicky and while I do like Vicky Subs, what I like on Netflix is that I can speed it up because I I do oh, it as fast as I do I do it as fast as Vicky? I can read. I will say though that I do have um, like a a Google add on that does let me speed up Vicky too. And I only oh, I fancy. only do that if I'm like in crunch time, like trying to finish a drama. I don't normally watch it like that. Okay, I was gonna ask like wow. Okay, so if you're driving in a car. K-pop or a podcast? Oh. A book. An audiobook. I know. You don't get to say. I knew you were going to try to do this, Amy. Yeah, it's this or that. Not you. this, that, or the you other. But I, I what if I don't do, do either of those? I know. Um, then you pick one. It's a game. <laughs> then you pick one. Fuck you. <laughs> I knew. I knew Amy was going to be like, I do Audible. I was like, fuck that. <laughs> Wow, that was a really, like, on-point imitation of me, Leah. Thank you. <laughs> um, I would choose um, podcast. <sighs> this, I have, like, a caveat if I'm by myself. No, just answer the podcast. question. Oh, God damn it. Then, then probably, then K-pop. K-pop. Okay. And just, you know, I would do our playlist because our playlist is really good. Our playlist is really good. Okay. Easy one. If Why aren't drama, you answering any of these? Oh, I can do this. So yeah. I would say Vicky and I would say K-pop. Okay. okay. If watching a drama, binge or savor? Binge, 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 binge. I will always binge. Savor. Binge. If someone dislikes a drama you love. It's fine to each their own, or I won't forget this affront. <laughs> do you mean like... And this is a drama you love. Yeah, I was going to say, like, how, like, what do you mean by love? Like, there's dramas that like I love, love, and there's it. dramas that you I love. It. No, it's a personal. Love it. It's a personal affront. Yeah, Gobble- it's a personal affront. It's like goblin or healer. Yeah, it's a personal affront. Yeah, it's yeah. a personal... It's an a Like, personal I'm not a robot. If you don't like it, I consider that a personal affront. Yeah. If you don't like, I'm not a robot. A personal yeah. affront to me as well. Yeah. Okay. Length of a drama, short or long? Short being like eight to twelve episodes, long being sixteen to twenty. I actually really prefer eight to twelve lately. I'm gonna go with eight to twelve. And I also like the shorter episodes that are usually in an eight to twelve. Like they're usually like around an hour or less. Mm-hmm. All right. You know me. I like long. Okay. Yeah, you're- <laughs> and then watch location, bed or couch. Bed. Couch couch all right Warm i up, fall asleep done. if i watch in bed like i i go to bed with the best of intentions with my laptop and then i pass out in like 10 minutes i i really i don't it's funny if i want to sounds if i want to fall asleep i put on a true crime video like youtube video mm-hmm. and i pass right like i pass right out to murder but if i'm <laughs> watching like a gay drama romance i do not fall asleep all right. Then I'm up to like 1 a.m. So now we're going to okay. go to the Patreon because they had a whole bunch. And I'm just going to, yeah, do they you did. all want to pick out or do you want me to keep going as like the host of this? You can keep going. Um, I like it because I looked at some of those and they were painful. And I know that some were like directed at me. <laughs> okay. Oh, really? Oh, that's funny. Okay. All right. Here's one. Fantastic drama with a disappointing ending or a just good drama that gets the ending right? 
just okay drama that gets the ending right. Nothing makes me more mad than a good drama with a bad ending. Nothing, nothing makes me more mad. <laughs> but, okay, so I'm going to play devil's advocate because mm-hmm. it, for me, it's harder to get through a just okay drama. So I feel like I want, I would go fantastic drama because like, look at that's me with uh, the King Eternal Monarch. True. To mm-hmm. me, that was a fantastic drama. The ending's not terrible, but they botched it. So yeah, I'm going to go with fantastic drama with a disappointing ending. That's Moon Lovers to me. Mm. okay here's a non-drama related one but i just saw it and i'm curious a month of paid vacation camping <clears throat> or a week of paid vacation hotel <laughs> wait say it again <laughs> a month of paid vacation camping or a week of paid vacation hotel I'm not. I mean, I like camp. I actually like camping, but I don't. I, I don't want to do it for a month. I don't. I don't even want to go to a resort for a month. So I would just say I don't want to go anywhere. I'm sorry. I like my home and my cats. So like a week, just a week. I would do a week in a hotel. I, I, mm-hmm. it would not be worth it for me for the month off to spend it camping. Oh. Yeah. Well, I mean, I would go month camping for. Sure. I know you would. I know you would. But you're a camper. Like, I am not. I'm a camper. <laughs> I like camping, too, but I just want to be home with my cats. Okay, here is one. Kim Tae-ri or Kim Go-on? Kim Tae-ri. Oh, I saw that with Kim Ji-won, too, on, on the Patreon. Somebody else had oh. Kim Tae-ri and Kim, J- Kim Ji-won. Uh, um, I like, uh, I'm uh, obsessed with Kim Tae-ri. <sighs> Kim Go-on. Mm, Kim Tae-ri. Okay. Nam Joo Hyuk or Park Seo Joon? Park Seo Joon. Oh, wait, wait, wait. And the loser gets erased from history. <laughs> <laughs> Who wrote that? That's me. No. I'm still going Park Seo Joon. I'm still going Park Seo Joon. I am too. I, bye bye. I'm Nam sorry. Ju-Hyuk. I'm sorry, Nam Joo I'm sorry. I just saw pictures of Park Seo Joon at um, the like Chanel oh. Paris. He's he got looks, the long hair, too. I can't. I can't. I can't. He looks... First of all, he looks younger. I don't know how. His face is like... He's definitely using the Kahi stick. I mean, he looks so good. He look. He's sitting next to Jenny, and he looks the same age. And they're not the same age. Yeah, Guys, he's going to be in a really Marvel good. movie in November. Like, I can't oh, handle it. You're, yeah. It's like your world's colliding. It is. All right um okay here's one that's for both of you because i haven't seen either of these tomorrow or if you wish upon me if you wish upon me now this is harder for me (laughs) (laughs) tomorrow tomorrow okay that's no that's fair okay that's hard that's it it, just you know i said it quickly but yeah um it's just i gotta go with your gut it's Ji Chang Wook. Yeah, right. I do go with my gut usually. Okay, so would you rather go camping with the hospital playlist gang or snowman making with the Reply 1988 crew? For this, I would camp. Because snowman. Yeah, I want to be with my, my doctors. I want to be with my... I I want to be with my 88 crew. What about um, you, I love the 88 crew, but I'm camping with the hospital crew. Okay, they'd be a lot of fun. And they play music. Yeah, we'd probably oh, like, have good we'd, food. We'd be able to like have sing-alongs, and <laughs> I'd have like three bananas and two eggs from the egg truck. At the <laughs> All right, no, you have a be... third of a banana. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, <laughs> stranded on a desert island with the cast of your very favorite K drama or your favorite K pop group. <sighs> no, I mean, no question for me. I'm going. With yeah. K-pop group. Yeah, you know what I think? I'm going. I'm I'm going with. Mm, no. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going with ATs, K-pop group. <sighs> BTS. Okay, Amy, are you doing BTS or are you doing Goblin? Goblin. <laughs> goblin. Yeah. I- <laughs> she wants to go with Kim Shin. <laughs> I'm going with Goblin. Yeah. Okay. Here is one that. Oh, okay. Are you Team Tech or Team Jung Hwan from Reply 19? <gasps> That's rude. With no spoilers. Oh. Jung Hwan. (laughs) 
fuck, man. Megan? I don't know. It, Boner Alley. <laughs> okay, look. I mean, fuck. I'm going team tech. I mean, that's hard. That's I, hard. I don't. There's no wrong answer there. Okay, I'm going to do one that's just for me because we did the tomorrow and would you yeah. rather. Um, so this do one it. is Jung Hyuk's hair in Faded to Love You, pre or post time jump. Oh my God. So look, <laughs> the iconic pre jump hair deserves a special mention in the Hall of Fame. But for sheer, just kind of like what I want to wake up to every day, I'm going with the post time jump. Okay. So, so can, Meg, I, or, can I give you the one that that I thought that you would appreciate too? Leah, yeah, that, yeah. Okay, so Lee Min Ho is Gu Jun Pio or Lee Min Ho is Ko I was going to give you this one. I was going <laughs> to give you this one. I mean, look. Ko Han Su, hot. I'm going Gu Jun Pio all the way. I mean, it's so hard because he's amazing in both roles. Like, he is super compelling as Ko Han Su, but I can't. I can't choose him <laughs> as that character because it's, I mean, if you think that Gu Jun Pio is problematic and you think Boys Over Flowers is problematic, you haven't met Kohansu yet. So yeah, Gu Jun Pio. Okay. Wait, can, can I pick one that feels feels directed at me? Yeah. yeah. Anbo An Hyun shower scene or Park So Joon workout abs showing scene? So Park So Joon in uh, Midnight Runners is... That's his like. Oh my floor, god, like... that workout scene! Is that or it's the An Bo Hyun. <laughs> what are you picking? I'm picking sad shower. I will pick An Bo Hyun sad shower every single time. Every single time. Every... Yeah, and just so you know, I... this I, this is not a spoiler. There is a there is a Lee Jun Ho sad shower scene. Okay. In Rainer's. Megan, I, just... I want you to remember. I want you to remember what you said just now. Same. I was just gonna say. I can't wait to ask you my question. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> okay, wait, wait. You're this or that? Yeah, yeah. But for, we'll for for you specifically that I have for you yeah. specifically. Okay. Well, now I'm scared. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's do a couple more okay. of these. Let's see. Okay. How about into the ring or go back couple? Oh, go back couple. Man. <gasps> yeah, I actually, as much as I love into the ring, I think I would choose go back couple. I'm doing actually. into the ring. Okay. That's hard though. Yeah, because they're very different. Okay, Kong Han Nul as Huang Yong Suk, or Park Se Joon as Ko Dong Man. So Wait, this I'm is sorry, when the again? camellia blooms. Okay. Kong Han Nul, or okay. Park Se Joon in Fight for My Way. Ko Park Se Joon, fight, fight for my way. Oh, Park Se Joon, Kong sorry. Han Nul, Yong Suk. I of course you are. But okay. Park Se Joon in Fight for My Way. Oh. <laughs> okay, Megan, this one's for you. M C okay. Wan as a villain. Or MC1 as a green flag. Oh, no. Oh, no. After just watching Summer Strike. After just watching Summer Strike, where he was literally The perfection. greenest green flag. And I'm only halfway through, but I love it. No, he is the greenest green flag in Summer Strike. <sighs> That's really... I, I love him as a villain, but he, no one plays a green flag hero like MC1. No right. one. So I'm choosing that. Final answer. That's hard, though. Okay, here's one for you, Amy. Grim Reapers or Serial Killers? <laughs> uh, Grim Reapers. All right. Although I do love okay. a good serial killer in a drama. This is for everyone. Attractive leads, but a bad story. Or great story, but unattractive leads. Great story. Yeah, I'm going to go with great story. Me too. Because I think that a great story can make anyone absolutely. Attractive. Yep, Agreed. I will always go back to I will always go back to my disappointment with personal taste, which has very attractive leads and not a very attractive story. Yeah, and I also think a bad story can make attractive people unattractive. Mm -hmm. Okay, Megan, here's one for you: Tale of the Nine Tailed or Strangers from Hell. <laughs> I just saw that one. Tell the nine tailed. Sorry, I, I'm I'm sorry. I'm always going to watch the Lee brothers. Okay, I'm going Strangers for Hell, and then I'll pick one out of this because I've seen it. Yumi sells season one or season two. Fuck, Ooh. I'm going two. Yeah, I'm going two. I thought you, yeah, I thought you get two. Okay, here's one. Make all your fellow podcast hosts join you to get <laughs> Ajuma Perm. <laughs> I 
That's awesome. Or amazing. make all your fellow podcast hosts join you for a community kimchi making day. Perms. We're getting perms. <laughs> I want to see us no, looking I like, make, I want to look like, the, I want to be our own Reply 1998 Ajumas. No, I want to make kimchi. But then I like cooking. <laughs> yeah, I want someone to make me kimchi, but I don't want to make it. I would say my goal is to make my own kimchi. Like, I, that that is one thing. I I like challenging myself when it comes to, like, cooking and baking. Um, And I would love to challenge myself to make kimchi. I've watched numerous videos on it now. And I feel like, I mean, it would never be a good as good as like a Korean ajma. Like, no way. But I feel like, would it be passable? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, okay. I am not. I do not want a perm, so I'm making kimchi. Can I just my hair's my my hair is curly enough. I know mine is too. Which is, I'm just. I want you to suffer in the curly hair, curly girl world with me. Yeah. Can I just okay, give? Want, can I give? Oh, just give a, a give props to Pauline in our. Um, patreon because one of hers is gong you or gong you <laughs> yeah <that was> nice. <laughs> i appreciate that all right here's one would you rather go to a jeju island resort or a luxury soul hotel jeju <sighs> yeah jeju i i want to go so bad. i do mm, i want a luxury soul hotel i mean i want to go there too <laughs> i want to go to both but I just, I don't know. I feel like there's just something, I don't know. It's magical. I want to find, I want to find where this, I want to find where the vat of Jeju oil is. <laughs> just bathe in it. <laughs> and maybe just I'll get look 25 Kahi sticks again. all over you. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Does anyone else have one on here that they want to pick or do we feel like we're good? Um, um, I've got, so Lee Dong Wook as Reaper or Lee Dong Wook as... Sorry, Lee Dong Ook as Reaper or Lee Dong Ook as Lee Yun from Tale of oh, Nine Tale. Oh, no. They're, oh, no. I know. I hate that one. Um, oh. Reaper. I'm, I'm actually, I'm actually going to say Tale of the Nine Tale. I think I would go Tale of the Nine Tale, too. I loved him so much with his red hair and his umbrella. I, I actually want to watch it again. I think I we have to before season two happens. We have to refresh. <laughs> oh, so someone wrote sugar or V. Oh, I mean, no question. <laughs> I mean, no. Question. Look, I mean, look, I, I, I would love you, baby. V. I love you, baby V so much. But sugar. Me too. But after friendcation, I just want to take care of baby V. You know? Like, well, that's okay. Maybe you want to take care of him more, but, you know. Yeah, no. Sugar. But yeah. I'm never going to not pick sugar. Oh, man. Okay. okay. Should yeah. we the hard stuff? All right. All right. I think we can get to the hard stuff. So, Megan, do you want to go first? Should we rock, paper, scissors and see who's going first? <laughs> how do you say it in Korean? Kai bai bo. That's how I don't it know, but we can that do how, it. That's how it sounds like. Okay. One, two. May, Amy, get in there. Amy, do rock, paper, scissors. One, one two, two, three. three. Oh, go. it's the, too early. Sorry. Oh, oh, we do three and then we go. Okay. Oh, one, sorry. one, two. two. Three, three, go. So Megan and I want to um, go. Megan okay, and so now Megan just and you... Amy and I do it. Okay, one, two, three, go. All right, so Megan, you go. Okay, okay. Megan. All right, this one is for Amy. I'm gonna go with Amy first. I'm nervous. Okay. Do you want to be in Quebec with Kim Shin and Untak? following them around so you get to see everything that they do but you're invisible to them <laughs> or do you want to be saved by captain re on his motorcycle and then sit next to him as he plays the piano in switzerland captain re because i don't want to be invisible ah, okay 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 it's I I, I would I thought I, you would I could just Quebec, I but I could just go and go see all the places. I I would, but pain I thought you want to see them. I know, but it would pain me to be there and not be able to like That's interact true. with them. Yeah, you'd want to hug Kim Shin. I would steal him away from Untak. I would. Okay. All right, Leo. Why don't you go? Okay. This one will be. Should you have one from Amy then, or one for Megan? Um, doesn't matter. 
I'll I'll do, do, Me- do Megan and we'll, we'll just kind of Megan. Yeah. Okay. Megan, would you mm-hmm. rather take a sad shower with Ungi and give him a happy ending <laughs> or de virginize healer in his snowy white feet? <gasps> oh, <laughs> <laughs> This is mean. I'm still going to choose Ungi. <laughs> really? Even over here? Ab- or she- Absolutely. Absolutely. I think I would enjoy the sad shower. Happy ending. All right. More. All right. I mean, I loved it. That was a good one. That is good. But I'm all I you don't understand <laughs> the impact. <laughs> Ungi sad shower had on me. Okay. Leah, you have to get one of the following tattoos. A giant Bjorn Johan on your neck. <laughs> okay. Or mm-hmm. okay. a small itty bitty one of Choi Si Wan on your upper arm that nobody will ever really see. <sighs> oh. <laughs> Choice you want. Wow. Okay. <laughs> you don't want a neck tattoo? <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I really have an aversion to neck tattoos if you made. No. Oh. I do too. All right. So, Amy, would you rather be forced to lick the ice cream off Eamon Ho's boot? But later he loves you so much that he will risk his evil mother's wrath for you and you can become a billionaire. (laughs) Or would you rather have Young Do grab your wrist way too hard in a private school, but later he does therapy and he's ready for commitment? (laughs) (laughs) Okay. Only because I am dying, dying for Kim Woo Bin as the romantic lead that I want so yeah. badly. I'm going to go with Young Doe. Young Doe therapy ready for me. Oh, You just want the best for him. I do. I do. I'm telling okay. you. I'm telling you. Like, oh. Ayers is all about Kim Woo Bin for me. Okay. Here is mine for Leah. <laughs> okay, Leah. Do you want to watch... Kong Han Nul in a gay romance, so a BL, as an isolated millionaire with a touch phobia (laughs) and facial scarring from a car accident who covets the eccentric delivery driver who brings him groceries once a week. Oh my God, write this. Oh God, I need that right now. Okay. Or watch Byun Yohan in a historical as a long suffering cousin to the future princess who could be with her if he reveals the secret of her real father. But if he doesn't, he loses her to a marriage with his best friend if she is crowned. <laughs> this, this is a very good first of all. Very good. <laughs> this is what I was giggling to myself. Is there an HEA in the second one? <laughs> <laughs> okay, they're both romances. Okay. Oh, fuck. I was so proud of my Read the second one again to me. Uh, Byun Yo Han in a historical is a long suffering cousin to the future princess. So there's incest. <laughs> yeah, you know, I love it. Uh, who could be with her if he reveals the secret of her real father. But if he doesn't and keeps her secret, he loses her to a marriage with his best friend when she's crowned. Or Kong Han Nul. I love it so much, but fuck. A BL with Kong Han Nul and a touch phobia, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I actually kind of thought you'd choose that one. But okay. both of them are great. And I, have, I would love to write them. I have another one. Wait, Amy, do you have one? I have one. For, yeah, I have one. I have, I have two for each of you. So I have, I have one for Megan now. Oh, you okay. have two? Yeah. Oh, you're such an overachiever. I am. Yeah, I have two as well. Oh, oh I only did. All right. Well, then you just oh, get to answer. So listen up. Suck it up, buttercup. Okay, so Megan, An Bo Hyun is signing a lifelong contract with a new studio where he A, either 
never takes his shirt off in a drama again, but gets some really stellar roles that are just beyond anything we've gotten to see him in yet. Or B, has to choose dramas <laughs> where it makes sense for him to be shirtless all the time. Like think like merman, wrestler, stripper. <laughs> okay. But but are they bad roles? I mean, you tell me what would a what would what would a drama where he never gets to wear a shirt be about? <laughs> yeah, it would probably be pretty bad. <laughs> Honestly, as much as I love you know a good like shirtless An Bo Hyun, I'm I want him to be like top top. Like I'm rooting for him so much, so I want him to choose roles that are stellar, even if he never gets naked again. A day in his life. He still can wear the fuck out of clothes. So. And he could get around it. You know, in military mm-hmm. prosecutor Doberman, he wore a tight shirt and had to jump in a river. For there we no go. Reason. Wet clothes. That still counts as being yeah. clothed. So sure. I would choose just very, very good roles because I want him to win like a Bexing. Fair. Okay, Amy. Mm-hmm. Would you rather... Mm-hmm. Bone gong you, but then be eaten by zombies on a train to Busan. <laughs> or bone Ijungi, but later you're killed in a cage in a basement. Ugh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> or die either way. Oh my god. Horribly. <laughs> horribly. I'm going zombie because that's going to be a quicker death. Yeah. <laughs> Or at least I get to yeah. turn and just be a zombie myself. Yeah, I'm going. <laughs> and maybe you could be like a zombie boyfriend with Gong Yu because he's a zombie too. Right. I could be next level of zombie too. You never know. I could be, a, you mm-hmm. know, a cognizant zombie who still has some humanity left. I don't know. I don't know. Wait, remember? Wait, Army of the Dead, the the like, that was like the, the Hollywood series? one. Yeah. But like, in Army of the Dead, there was like. Yeah, they have like a zombie colony. Like, they had like a zombie colony and there was like a head zombie, a head male zombie. You're making it sound good. Like... No, you're just a fucking zombie. No. There's no H-E-A no, in No, listen. One. He had like a zombie girlfriend. And when she died, he lost his shit yeah. and was like, I'm avenging her. And honestly, Because she was, was also a pregnant for. zombie girlfriend. Yeah, I was kind of rooting for him. It was a bananas be movie. I was like, it was bananas. It was, it was absolutely bananas. Okay. Right, Megan, I've got one for you. Oh, I've got, I've, I say, I've got another one for each of you, so. Okay. Do you want to do, yeah, okay, do me, and then I'll do Megan, and then you do Megan. Okay. So, Leah, alternate history. Yu Yun Suk falls ill during the shooting of Mr. Sunshine, and a new actor needs to take over the role of Gu Dong Mei. Who do you choose? Ooh. Kang Han or Im Si Wan? Oh. Oh. <laughs> So who's the new Gudong? Who's the new Gudong? So am I going with the tiny compact king who can bring a real fucking psycho? He would though. Can you imagine? Mm-hmm. Can you imagine him with MC1. the sword? MC1 would be fucking. You wouldn't think it. No, but he's amazing. MC1. If you, I feel like you have to see Strangers from Hell to know what that man is fully capable of. Yeah, and, and then he's in that new movie where he's. Like, but I feel like his little face of longing. Oof. Yeah. Oof. And like his hatred and love all mixed up together, he'd be so good. He's really doing it for Kong me Han in in Summer Strike. And I, I was telling Megan, I'm like, I don't know what it there's a whole combination of things I think that just didn't hit me right with um with Run On, but I love him in Summer Strike mm. and I'm I'm definitely a fan. Yeah, me so, I, mean, I was he's obsessed amazing. with him. He's amazing. He is so he is all the green flags yeah. in Summer Strike. I can't a tell you how good me saying is. I'll tell you it forever until someday somebody just decides they're going to watch we'll it. watch it. Okay. <laughs> it's so <laughs> good. Okay. Megan, would you rather have to lick and suck on Oju's toes after a long day of work every night? After, like, you know, peeling off the toe socks. Or have to live in a My Mr. Apartment <laughs> drinking three Maxims a day as your sustenance? Ugh. How do you? How, this is not even hard for me. Do like, I also have to drag my granny to the bathroom in yeah. a shopping cart? <laughs> do I also have an ET granny. <laughs> oh, I. 
<laughs> so uh, if I if I sucked on Anju's toes, <laughs> would I like have? Would I also be living the high life? Could be. I mean, it's not. It's not known. It's probably not a bad day. Yeah, I would probably choose that. Yeah, I, I, mean, would, I would choose- probably pay him to let me. Yeah, I would choose the maximum, yeah, I, like a hundred times. Would you live- yes, no. no, I cannot. No, I'm not suck. With- I cannot suck toes after would, a day. I'm not toe living socks. with ET Granny. I I'm not living it, with ET Granny. I would take it down to the ankle. Oh, <laughs> I'm like getting physically ill. No, I don't want to suck anybody's clean toes. Like I don't want anybody's I have- toes in my goddamn fucking mouth. <laughs> hey, I do have to tell you. I did tell you. Neil has the biggest blood blister gross his no one we, toe. please no <laughs> listen because listen, he's, been, he's been running and he keeps showing no. it to me no and no. i was like neil and like i'm trying to be like i don't know i guess supportive of like his running journey but i was like that is the, i draw the line you cannot get that toe near me i don't want to see it and i don't want to hear about it he bought these little like i don't know like rubber toe guards and so he's been walking around in his sandals that are Squidward sandals with these like toe covers on. I mean, it is like, I'm like, this is what we are now at 40. We're just. Tell him to buy yoga toes. <laughs> We're just. He... I have a toe. Walking around sounding like Squidward. I have toe separators. Toe They're called yoga toes and they stretch out your toes and so... you wear them for like 15 minutes and they feel wonderful. Well, when I was in my early nice. 20s and I was dating Nick. We did a big backpacking trip, and I got a blood blister on my toe, and I went and stayed with his- Where the fuck is this conversation going? (laughs) I stayed with my- I stayed with his parents. He was gone. He went to, like, some conference, so I was alone with them, and I didn't know them that well. And his mom had this, like, cute room that I could stay in. It had, like, this perfectly starched white bedspread. No. And I was (laughs) sitting on the bed, and I don't know what I was thinking. It was like, you know, I make bad decisions sometimes. (laughs) But I, I already know where this is going. Pin, and I stuck it in the blood blister for some reason because I was just sick of it. And I don't know what I was thinking, but blood just shot out like a cannonball all over the bedspread. <gasps> and then I had to go find my mother, my who was not my mother in law, was my boyfriend's mom, and be like, "Uh, I got toe blood all over the comforter of like the guest room." <laughs> I'm so sorry, <laughs> listeners, for where this is She was is probably gone. like, are you sure my son didn't de-virginize you on our sheet? <laughs> he like, wasn't the there. No, and I'm like, it's my it toe blood. Toe I just blood? have like copious toe blood all over your nice <laughs> linen. Copious toe blood. <laughs> <laughs> You're making the Anoju question even easier. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Yeah, what if, <laughs> what if Anoju had... <laughs> blood blister. I would. I just vampire that shit. I am not living in that apartment drinking Maxim for my life. It's not how I'm, I'm not live. either. I'm not. I'm not doing it. Look, it's a little Sometimes bit. Sometimes of... you have to make sacrifices. What's in blood? Zinc. <laughs> I don't know. Like <laughs> iron. 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 What are we even talking about? Blood. We're talking about sucking on someone's dirty ass sweaty <laughs> toes at the end of yeah, the day. If you had a blood blister, I'd still choose it. Yeah. I I'm dry not, heaving. I'm, I'm dry heaving. All right, Megan, I have a question for you because we need to get off the toes. <laughs> okay, so Megan, this is my, my, my second one for you. Okay. Never watch I Am Not a Robot again or have to watch an episode of The Sound of Magic every day for the rest of your life. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I know Amy. what I do. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be, like, be like, bye bye, I'm not a robot. I'm a good memory. I will always treasure. I will always love you. <laughs> Every day? Every day. Look, I'm not a robot is my top drama, but I have good memories and I'll just keep those memories. I'm not watching Sound of Magic every day. I'm not. That's torture. Torture. That is, watching that man <laughs> just get on a carousel <laughs> for the rest of my life. Watching Bella the bird die for the rest of my life. I'm not doing it. Or watching him almost choke a teenage girl. Oh, yeah. Watching him almost kill a teenage girl. <laughs> no. 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 Oh. All right. Well, these were good ones. Oh, my God. I'm crying. I know. 
well, I'm sorry. I only had one each. I'm so, I guess that was as far as my creativity went. I you were so that, proud uh, of those, and they were good. Yeah, so they were really. You know, I was proud of mine. I was proud. And I hope that those listening at home played along, and you can, you know, let us know what you chose out of those, or if you felt like we had any large missteps. Blood blisters. That was a misstep. Mi- blood blood do you blisters. Do want to be in a, a big <laughs> Hovel drinking your three Maxims a day as your I only love Maxim. Meal. I want Maxim in my mouth, <laughs> not Anno Jew's toes. I want. <laughs> so you're like I want Maxim and sadness in my mouth. Rather than yeah. Anoju and a his spa safe day. full of money. Yeah, I'm like, and then I go to the spa for the day, and I go to the dentist and garg, you know, professionally gargle out my mouth. <laughs> Enjoy. I mean, I would actually like gargle free. out I would my do mouth. It, I would do it for free. I would do it for free. Yeah, I might too. <laughs> Just so he makes well, that well, weird little noise where he's like, <laughs> he'd be like, "Oh, you dirty little girl." <laughs> I'm not at all sad with my decision. At all. Oh, God. Somebody out there is joining me for the maxim in the hovel of an apartment. I know they are. And then, like, bonus points if he, like, grabs the back of your hair while you're doing it. <laughs> while you're deep-throating his toes. I can't. I'm crying. My stomach hurts. <laughs> <laughs> all right i'm gonna wrap this up because they don't need to listen to all the wheezing <laughs> oh my god my stomach hurts oh, shit. <sighs> thank you so much for playing along everybody i hope Crack you enjoy your maxim or your toes whatever you decide <laughs> i'm crying <sighs> All right. Okay. <laughs> Anyang. <laughs> Anyang. <laughs> Kamsamni da. Thank you for listening to Afternoon of Delight. Where can you find us outside the pod? Head on over to afternoonadelight.com. That's A F T E R N O O N A D E L I G H T. Dot com. You'll find links to all our social media, our book recs, K-pop and K-skincare recs, and if you want even more Afternoon of Delight, because really who doesn't, you can join our Patreon, where you can choose the patron level that's right for you. Join in daily K-drama conversations, listen to bonus podcast episodes just for patrons, and participate in our monthly live K-drama support group via Zoom. We can't wait for you to be a part of the community. Until next time, Annyeong!